Hi, my name is Kyle. I'm a sound recording technology major here at Syracuse University. Let me show you what a day in my life looks like. As a sound recording technology student, or what we refer to as SRT, my days are generally a good mix of activities split between the recording studio, Krauss College, and on and off campus. There's a lot to do and see in upstate New York. Let's jump straight to it. On a busy day, you might find me in the Belfer Audio Archive and Laboratory, a recording studio and audio archive. Belfer is equipped with a lot of vintage and modern analog gear, along with digital equipment and all of the industry standard plugins. It has a great live room with both a live and dead end, which makes it a very flexible recording space. I've recorded and mixed a really wide variety of music in Belfer, including jazz, rock, and classical. The song I'm working on today is from a band my friends are in, two of whom are other SRT majors. The studio also boasts a large microphone collection with industry standard brands. The collection of wax cylinder records here is the largest held by a private institution in the world, and one that provides an important learning opportunity for students. The Belfer Audio Archive was also the first studio ever designed for audio preservation in 1963, and has a collection of over 500,000 sound recordings and related items. This includes equipment capable of playing back historic formats. Preservation, digitization, and restoration work are also done here. Another important learning opportunity I have as an SRT student here at Syracuse University is the chance to receive hands-on experience mixing and recording. Through SU Recording Services, students like me have the opportunity to record and mix over 200 live performances annually, working with other SRT students and faculty. Recording Services operates within the Setner School of Music to record live performances in historic Krauss College, where you can find me when I'm not in Belfer. I've really enjoyed getting to record these performances, as it's always a lot of fun to capture the different styles of performances that happen in Setner. Plus, it's given me the opportunity to record students who I would have a harder time getting into Belfer. Krauss 406 and 407 are the two spaces the SRT program has in Krauss College. 406 doubles as a classroom and is the control room for recording whatever happens in Setner Auditorium. On other days, I can be found practicing my instrument. My primary instrument is electric bass, and through my program, I receive private music lessons. My private teacher this semester was Boris Kozlov, who's helped me learn aspects of jazz music that I hadn't been familiar with before. Lessons are conducted by music faculty who are experts in a particular field or instrument and work around my schedule. This semester I've had lessons over Zoom, but in the past lessons have been one-on-one -on -one in person. There are also many ensembles for me to join as a music student. I've been a member of the Morton Schiff Jazz Ensemble and the University Orchestra since I was a freshman, and I've always loved the diversity of music I've had the opportunity to practice and perform. I do need a break every now and again, and there's plenty to do for fun on and off campus. In my downtime, I enjoy hanging out with my friends in our house. We play video games, sit on our porch, share meals, and study together. Some of my closest friends are in fact other SRT majors in my class. Taking a majority of my classes with the same people really helped me make some close friendships. Through the friends I've made in the SRT program, I've had some amazing opportunities to play in bands and both perform and record outside of the school. I performed at the Westcott Theater, which is also a large concert venue in downtown Syracuse. I've also gotten to perform at other houses, restaurants, and festivals in and around Syracuse. Because SU is only a couple hours away from Philadelphia, I got to take a weekend trip and play a show at a Temple University venue. That pretty much sums up what a day in my life as a sound recording technology student at Syracuse University looks like. I have access to world-class facilities like the Belfer Lab with both modern and vintage gear. Hands-on work experiences are provided by my job with the SU recording facilities, and I also get to play my instrument in both private and group instructions all in a city that feels both large and small at the same time, surrounded by a supportive community of music students. Have any questions or concerns? Leave them in the comments below, or even better, submit an info request and a college representative will get in touch with you soon.